WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant and sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of green today. We've got all the U.S. indices that we track trading the upside. Dow's up 85 points, about a quarter of a percent, four tenths for the S&P, six tenths for the NASDAQ 100, 101 points there. The Russell's up six tenths. That's a 12-point move. Semis are up uh, about eight tenths or 39, 38 points out there. Trainers are up 169. That's a little over 1%. For it, gold's up 21 bucks, silver's up a buck, lights recruiters up 61 cents, natural gas is basically flat, 30 year treasury trading down 13 ticks at 117.10, and the US dollar index is off at least 422, at least 42 cents as we speak right now, trade out at 104.14. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart. We begin with the ES mini upper left hand side. What do we know? Yesterday, price got all the way down to test support. First level of support is the top of its daily profile. Tested this morning as well. Can't bust them down. Says it wants to try to bust them to the upside. Now, we've got an inside day here. That's all we've got. If price were to close above yesterday's high, then I would say we likely have a two day rally out there. If we take a look at the spot volatilix, it is trading lower, but it is still above its 50 day exponential moving average. If price were to close below 1381, that's the 50 day exponential moving average, then I would also say that the ES penny would likely rally for at least two sessions. If we take a look at the NQ, big day to the downside, but never got back to test support. Uh, the support level would be the top of its profile, 18,158. Much like the ES mini, it's an inside bar as we speak right now. Only a close above yesterday's high would signal at least a two-day rally. U.S. dollar index is in the process of forming a new daily profile. It has shifted several times. I've got a new profile right now. It has resistance up at the 10. Uh, 459 level and support in the 103.85 to 104.09 area. That would be the buy zone. And price right now is trading out at uh, 104.13. Goldilocks has an A to B equals CD pattern of the upside. Price projection of 23.27. Silver has an A to B equals CD price projection. 28.23 is its price target, but I would say more likely than not, it would be the 29.26 level. You've got lights recruited and an A to B equals CD pattern above profile, likely targeting 87.60. Natural gas has got a roads momentum indicator bottom for its daily time frame that formed last Thursday. And price right now is consolidating with inside its profile. It has resistance up at the 187 level. And today, if we see a close below 118, I'm sorry, 11, what we likely get is an A to B equals CD pattern of downside. The pattern's already in place out here. The question is, can price take out that swing low? 116 and about 116.10 or so would be its price objective. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you're off to start your Wednesday, have a wonderful one. Thanks for joining us, and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.